Hey everyone, it's the Awesome Daddy here, and welcome to Rise of the Tomb Raider 20th Year Celebration. Now, this just came out literally two minutes ago. I mean, I'm not even kidding. Look, look at the time. Two, two oh six, like twelve oh six. It came out six minutes ago. It, this originally came out last year as an Xbox One exclusive. Then it came out six or six or seven months after that as a PS, PC exclusive. Now here it is, Rise of the Tomb Raider on the PS4. 20th year anniversary. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, everybody. This is going to be a full on walkthrough of the entire game, plus the two DLC that came with it the Baba Yaba and the other one. I, I don't know what it's called, but I know it's the other one. It's like the Lord Croft Manor thing. So, from what I can gather, this takes place, I think, a year after the original Tomb Raider. The Tomb Raider, the, no, not the original one, I mean, like the Definitive Edition, the, the remake. The, it takes place a year after the remake. So Lorecroft has left the island, all that with the Sun Queen and all that, all that's gone. And from what I can gather, what's happening in Rise of the Tomb Raider, it, we're in the snowy wilderness of Siberia, I think, and we do something where I think it's immortality. I think that's the big treasure, or like the big mystery of this, is immortality. So this is going to be a full-on walkthrough, guys, plus the review at the end, with the two DLC, so I'm super excited for that. Tomb Raider was like one of the first... Um, adult games I actually was excited to get excited to own because when I had the PlayStation I owned a few games I owned Crash Bandicoot Spyro and Tomb Raider and my parents didn't think Tomb Raider was like a bad game for me to play at the time but considering the fact that it was still considered an M I think it was considered like an M or T game that was still like way above the games I used to play like I usually I used I'm used to playing like great E you know, you play like games that like you know teach you something or like it's all colorful and all like magical and oh happy fun time. But I think Tomb Raider was the first game I played where it wasn't like that. It was sort of semi-realistic. So I'm actually really excited to play this. I've heard nothing but great things from Rise of the Tomb Raider. So what, without any further ado, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And let's get into this. Yes, sex save file. Uh. See, let's pick normal. Combat aim assistance disabled. Enemies have normal health and damage. What? What's extreme swimmer? Disabled. Health regeneration. Enemies have increased health. Enemies have increased senses. More difficult enemies will be present. There are fewer resources. Game only saves at campsites. Okay, I'm gonna go two I'm gonna go with normal. Go back to difficulty because I played the original, the remake, the definitive edition, and I did quite well on that. I did really good at that. And I'm pretty sure what I'm going to do makes someone too. reach beyond the boundaries of human experience to face the unknown. As children, we question the world around us. We learn, we accept, and gradually we lose our capacity for wonder. But some do not. The explorers, the seekers of truth. It is these pioneers who define the future of mankind. The others, they're done. No amount of money is going to get them through those mountains. The lost city's up there, somewhere. That's going to be a hell of a climb. I'm not turning back. I know. You should stay here with them. Not a chance. So guys, I want to link. I want to say this is like the very similar. The we'll graphics have a good view of the valley is beyond a lot from the summit. To All right. The Phantom Mission. Let's take it easy here. Which is not really a bad thing, but it's it's a little bit of a step up. This That's what I really like. We just need to keep moving. The Phantom Mission 
will really amazing and hey, take that towards even if we don't find anything up here put it in rise of the would be proud. Is, is this for I know I've heard but I have a good feeling about this game. Even like entire year has passed, and the game still holds up to being one of the greatest. Oh, oh shit! Careful, you okay? careful, Laura. Careful, Not Laura. But for it to I'm be fine. like over a year, like old, and still to be talked about as like, one of the best sequel remakes. Oh, 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 what the fuck? Oh, 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 well, it's happy. It's not too right? breaking without climbing. Jonah! Okay, so a lot of people, including myself, I'll refer to Tomb Raider as a female no. Nathan Drake. That's like a dangerous. female Charter. But I want to know, like, what do you guys think? Like, I can climb back up. Do you think that's, that's Are true? You sure? Do you think that's You're true that Laura Croft is like a female Nathan Drake, or like how Charter and, and Tomb Raider are kind of the same game company? Like, no, not game company, but like sort of the same sort of game. I personally, I see a lot of similarities with it. I would say that they're exactly the same, but there are a lot of <laughs> there are a lot of similarities with it. But if I had to I choose to a favorite, I honestly don't know what okay. to choose. Now grab my hand. Got it, got it, got it. Catch me, Jonah! Catch me! Gotcha. Thanks, Jonah. <sighs> Shit, but Mark. if I had to choose, I honestly You're don't know what to choose is better. Are you okay? Tomb Raider or Nathan Drake? Yeah. Because they both. Come they on. both prove that the whole archaeology and treasure hunting thing is still a great gaming concept. They prove it indefinitely, and I honestly don't know what to do. Like I mean, Two Bear came first, obviously, but I, I don't know. Like, what do you guys think? What, what do you think is better, Two Bear or Uncharted? The Two Bear series or the Uncharted? I wonder, like, I wonder, like, what the fuck, what the fuck are we doing here? I know we have to look for the something about immortality. I know this is a long shot. Yeah, it is a long shot. But that old tracker said he saw ruins up in these mountains. Yeah. Oh! Ooh, ooh. But I don't no. know much about what we're finding. I guess if I was this, gonna hide a lot of city. But I know I have to do this something. This might be the kind of god second place. Something where, like. I, something about immortality. I, I don't know much. I'm pretty sure I'll learn more as I get to this game. I know I'll learn more I about it. I just hope Trinity has a feeling to it. But all I can say is that it has to do with immortality. Storm's getting closer. We have a couple hours at most. Okay, a couple hours at most. Come on, Jonah. Oh, wait. Should be enough for those time. who haven't played We're um, almost to the, top. the original Rise of the Tomb Raider, not Rise of the Tomb Raider, I mean Tomb Raider, the remake, aka the fifth edition, that's one of the survivors of the Endurance, Jonah, who helps you out during the original Tomb Raider. The what do you think? Edition. We're close to something, Jonah. I can feel it. Just this last stretch to the top. All right. Let's see what's up there. Feels pretty solid here, but keep close to the wall. Okay. Oh, shit. Looks like we climb from here. If I know too, Raider, this shit's about to go. This is right. about to go down real fast. Let's Ready? do it. Three, two, one. Ah! <sighs> <sighs> Find the old Tomb Raider. Shit's about to go down, and it's not gonna be pretty. Come on, Jonah. Let's do this. There's lots of loose ice up here. Fuck. Let's take it slow and steady. Just stay Get with slow me. Slow and steady. What's the race, Jonah? Oh, oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Jonah, you okay? That was close. You telling me? Okay. How can? How the fuck can you do all this, Lord Robbie? I mean, I mean, yeah, I get it, like, in the first one, you, like, in the first two later, the definitive edition, I liked how it went from Laura Croft to a normal teenager, like a normal, like, girl, to be this part of that, how it molded her into this part of that. No, no, no. Oh, fuck. Hold on. Fuck. I'm going to dig in. Can you make it across? I can make it. Ready? Are you sure? Uh, oh. Holy fuck. shit. I don't think I can make that jump. Stay there! I'll anchor a line for you at the top! Alright, Jonah. Alright. I'll calm. give you some slack. Alright. Thanks, Jonah. But, uh, I like how the first Almost one, there, where it was, you got it. like, a red shoot on the regular girl, who basically she shoot molded into this badass machine. And now she molded by the events of what's happening. Ugh. And how it made her into a badass, more cross than we all know love. 
And so this one, she's already the badass for a prom. And I want to see how they will further that mindset. How they'll make that home. Oh shit, that was the Dona, end. We made it! I see the ruins! <laughs> Laura, look out! Oh god! Oh, oh fuck! Shit, oh, it's gotta be lightning! Oh fuck! Laura, look out, look out, look out! Oh! 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 I got you! Oh, that gotta oh. hurt! Can you hear me? Oh, that's gonna hurt. I'm gonna pull you back up. Oh, stop. Shit. Shit. There. Over there. Yeah, over there. Swing, swing me over there. Quick. Swing me to the other side. Okay. Okay. Here goes. Back and forth. Back and forth. Come on. Just like it. Just like an original one. Back and forth like this. Damn it. I can't hold on much longer. Damn it. I got it. I got it. Fuck! Hold on, Dota! I got this! I got this! Uh, oh. no. Fuck! No! No! Fuck, Dota! Laura! I can't hold you! The rope is slipping! One more, Dota! One more! I can do this! I can do this! Oh, I am Laura Croft, damn it! Uh. Come on, come on, gotcha! Maybe it's the guy I'm doing, Dota! I'm climbing for my life! Aw, oh, you oh, gotta shit. be kidding me! Oh, God damn it! Go back, Jonah! Get to shelter! Oh, fuck, 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 Every Laura Croft game, I can never catch this fucking part. Every two breaker, every freaking uncharted, I can never catch a break. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! 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 Fucking! Okay. Okay, we made it. Don't know how? Oh shit! Oh! Without snow does not like Laura Croft. Oh wait, which well, brings up another thing. I know some of my friends call Laura as Lara. No, it is Laura. Her name is Laura. Did I die? What? Uh, I think I. What? Well, I died. What the fuck? Shit. Well, I thought I, was, I thought legit that had to happen. Okay, I didn't know I died. But, uh, Fuck, come on, come on, I can do this! Oh, oh fuck, 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 fuck! Ah! I can do this! Nathan Drake, be my guide! I'm a strong, independent woman, and I don't need no man! Oh, fuck, hold on, Laura! It is the greatest cruelty of life that we're all too swiftly taken from it. We age, we decay, we die. But what do we leave behind? Bones? Dust? What of the soul? Does it endure beyond our earthly existence? I believe it does. A truth lies at the heart of many myths and stories. A truth not of science, but something more profound. The key to unlocking everlasting life. I may have found the next piece to the puzzle, but I'm not alone in this search. They're following me. 
watching my every step. I know them by name now. Trinity. An ancient, violent sect with designs on controlling the future of humanity. I must proceed carefully for the sake of my family. If anything were to ever happen to Lara or Anna, I could never forgive myself. The gutter press was attacking you again. I thought you could use some company. No lies. Were you followed? Followed? Of course not. What's going on? I think I found the tomb. Oh, you can't be serious. The myth of the Prophet is real. Dad was right. Lara, your father was... unwell. No. He was close to a great discovery, tangible evidence of the immortal soul. I loved Richard. I would have married him if he'd asked. But he was a broken man. I don't want to see you end up like him. But Anna, he was right. It was everyone else who was wrong. The tomb's in Syria. Syria? Oh God, Laura, no. This is madness. Get your life sorted. Go home to the manor. You know I can't go back there. But this obsession ruined your father. I saw something. Something I... I can't explain. Now I understand what Dad was going through. It's all fairy tales. Nonsense. Don't go down this road. You know where it leads. It's the only thing that makes sense to me now. I'm going to find the Prophet's tomb. <laughs> should be an oasis in the canyon just ahead. You're wasting your time. There's nothing out here. Just keep driving, please. It's your money. Something isn't right. Oh, that's just local militia. You told someone, didn't you? They, they paid better than you! You both! Shit! They weren't supposed to shoot at us! Get us out of here! Shit! Shit! No, no, no!
That's a great start. It has to be you. That's a great start to the game. Oh, fuck. Ugh. I have my gun out. That's a great start to the game, guys. Shit, we're all being shot. Damn, so somebody doesn't want to find this new shit. Was this me or like, did Lord Croft's face, facial expression, and head look very weird in the custom of the There was something Anna. in Dad's research yeah. about I don't this. No, but it looked weird to me a little bit. It was said the Prophet's tomb was hidden in the cliffs above one of the forgotten cities. Um, Legend speaks of an oasis where the Prophet was laid okay. to rest. So video game, okay, so video game logic. See the thing that's sticking out? Yeah, we can climb that. Apparently we can. Oh! You know, I always want to... I, I say this a lot in my Enchard series, but I always want to learn how to do Park 4 like this. I always want to learn this. Oh, fuck! I mean, it seems like a pretty cool skill to have. I mean, think about it, like, you can climb almost any surface as long as it has something sticking out of it. You look like a pretty good skill to have. Something's here. What's here? Could this really be it? Um, I don't know. Go inside, find out. Ugh. Get my gun out, just in case. Oh, fuck. Wait, but what the fuck? Health? I have- wait, is that like a health pack or something? What the fuck? So, one thing I like that they're doing with the series so they're making Incredible. it more and more realistic and more a chart like Some kind of marker. Or some kind of giant. Can't quite thing. make out the translation. But this word. What's it mean? If you can't make out a translation, how you know what the word means? Prophet! Wait a minute, if you can't make out the translation, then how you know it means prophet? Profit. I'll to discover. Oh! Mm, it's some yeah, sort of and that's more Greek translation skill. Script, what? But I can't I'm gonna, quite make it out. I have to basically unlock her. Okay, he's shown here performing healing miracles. Dad's notes mentioned this. Um. Three moral descriptions to increase the language skill. That's. I'm not gonna lie, that's kind of. BS for me. I, I, I have to admit, that's actually one of the things I don't like about Rise of Tomb Raider. Prophet. Like, wait a minute. Speaking with Technically, a Lara Croft is an archaeology major. Like, down their she has like a shit ton of degrees in archaeology, so sh should she you know, know how to speak some of these languages? He led his followers them? through the desert. To the I'm oasis. pretty sure when, you're, when she's trying to get her like archaeology degree or, you know, something, I'm pretty sure she took a few classes Still in. Time. Deciphering ancient shit. All right, let's go. Constantine wants to breach the tomb before sundown. Uh, Constantine? I thought it was Constantine. They're after the tomb. Yeah, I know. Let me translate. I've got to find it before them. Okay, so can I translate this? There we go. Mm, my Greek is still a little rusty, but, but it's pointing to something hidden nearby. Okay, you mean this? I'll mark down the locations. Oh, like, like this. This is okay. Breakthrough. <sighs> Use your lore cross strength. Do it. A secret entrance. That we will destroy! So much for being an archaeology student. Ugh. I'm pretty sure when you're an uh, archaeology student and you're learning about, you know, going on an expedition on this, I'm pretty sure one thing they teach you is that not to destroy. Whoa. It's amazing. Dad could wait, wait, what? This. What? Yeah, this is one thing I never got. This is one thing I never understood in like a charted or like more and two minutes. One thing I never really understood is like the thing is like not. It's not really that hidden. It's like seriously, like it's like, it's like in plain sight. But how did no any other archaeologist discover this? Like seriously, like how did nobody stumble upon this? I get it that you know it's like it was like sort of. It is, but like it's out of the open. Oh no. Already yeah, see, they already don't they're right, they're inside. right here. So how like no any other party Oh! Oh how did any other Okay. How did like any other archaeologist not find Oh shit 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 oh, no. Fuck Fuck Okay I don't like my thing crumbling behind me Ugh Oh oh oh, oh. Well, I just broke every bone in my body. <laughs> I just broke every bone in my body. Try to get around you. So, 
Okay, the wheel's not there. It's, it looks like we, it looks like we use this to climb. <sighs> yeah, so why did it hang on before? Why is it that before it did hang on? She just gave up. She was like, no, I'm done. I'm done for today. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna call quits. I'm gonna break every more part of my body. The Order of Trinity pursued the Prophet and his people relentlessly until finally confronting them in their hidden oasis. Okay, this must be it. So, Trinity, what I can gather is that Trinity is sort of like the Templar from Assassin's Creed. We want to control humanity through evil, evil guy ways. And apparently they want something to do with, like, I don't know, immortality? And like the prophet is somebody who like has the immortality and they chasing after the prophet Damn and his people? Come on. Oh fuck. fuck. Oh! oh! Okay. Okay, we don't like it. I don't like the jump scares. I don't really have to deal with enough of that shit, rest of the evil. Ew, 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 scorpion! Ew, 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 oh, away his mouth. Oh, that's gross. Oh my gosh, I always have to deal with enough of this bullshit in Resident Evil. Uno! Dos! And I'm free! <laughs> hey dude! Hey skeleton dude! More of the two passage. Oh. God. There was a battle here. No shit! Armed soldiers against religious pilgrims. Oh, uh, looks like another the one. The Order of Trinity. Death of Allah, put inside small containers. The rewards. Okay. Okay, rewards. Ooh, I can learn my. I can learn more the Greek. Prophet slain by the order of Trinity. Oh shit. Yeah, so Trinity is evil. We don't have for sure. Trinity is fucking evil. That I know that for sure. My son, the order of Trinity has received word that the prophet's followers are building a great tomb at an oasis outside Berea. But more upsetting. While we thought they were building the tomb for their prophet, Trinity now believes he still lives. We have learned he is preaching his heresy among the local citizens, drawing more to him daily with his tales of how he conquered death. He is a liar and a heretic, claiming miracles that come only from the divine. You swore he was dead. Have you failed us? Uh, well, technically, if this dude's immortal, then I'm pretty sure a stab in the <sighs> chest wouldn't do jack diddly shit. I mean, I'm pretty sure being immortal means you can't die. The big stab in the chest, you just look at you and be like, really? <laughs> you look at you and be like, really? You do know I'm immortal, right? Oh! Ooh. Damn it. That was too close. Yeah, you can say that again. Fuck. Crap of death. But like, yeah, if you know this guy's immortal, then how can a single stab in the chest, like, do anything to They're it? blasting their way in. Oh! Shit. Oh, what the fuck? I'm getting freaking defeated on this shit. Fuck that. Okay, someone gotta tell me. I gotta do it. Wait, I have infinite ammo? I have infinite ammo! Yes! Yes! Infinite ammo! Okay, this I don't know why I did that. Let me bust this down. Before I do that, is there anything else I can need? Mm, that wall looks weak. I know. Uh, uh, and. Uh, Let's hope this works. Yeah, same here. Uh, see, I'm gonna have to. See, when it comes to puzzles and like Tomb Raider and, and Uncharted, I've pr pretty much got this. I've pretty much got this. Although, I think. And Uncharted, the puzzles are a lot easier because you have the journal that basically gives you the answer to the puzzle. <laughs> oh! <laughs> shit. Fuck! No! Oh, shit. Shit! Fuck, fuck, fuck! Ugh. Swim, Laura Croft! Swim! I'll swim faster. Come on, come on! I'm not drowning here! Come on, come on! Ugh. Oh. Let's not do that ever again. Let's not do that ever again. Fucking take that. I have to waste some infinite ammo bullets now. Hope you're happy. 
Whoa! Stunning. We made it, Dad. So that's going to be it for this part, guys. We'll come back a little bit more and more of this tomb to finding out more about this prophet and this trinity thing. So, thanks for all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you all in the next awesome Tomb Raider. Wait, reload. Tomb Raider, rise of the Tomb Raider part. Peace out, everyone, and have a marvelous, spectacular day. I'm fucking poisoned. I'm already poisoned. I'm already poisoned. I'm already poisoned. I'm already poisoned.